Today's part two of plowing. Over here, my field, garden, whatever you want to call it. I like to call it a field because it seems like a really big garden to me. My truck in the way. I got I got uh got half of it done I I'd say. I'm going around in circles. Going outside in, and then maybe next year I can go inside out. And I'm gonna cultivate it with my cultivator. Over there. I found some lime I'm gonna spread before I finish plowing. This is gonna be pumpkins. I also found these apps on the app store to track my spending. And I found this other app that tracks my um, hours I work and hours of my other work workers, if I ever do hire other workers. And I can also give them a pay. I'll just track like friends hours and stuff. I'll post, I'll add some screenshots of those to this video, and I'll uh, screenshot the logos of them, and I'll screenshot the, the actual inside of it, like when you open them up, and how to use it. Won't go too in depth, that'll probably be in just another video this winter. It gives me something to actually talk about because this winter it's probably going to be pretty boring. I'm going to sit around, do nothing to this snow cover covered plot. Can't do anything when it's frozen. Alright, let's go get to it. I got to put a bolt in my tractor. Another grade 8, I believe. The strongest bolt we have in our garage. Hmm. Whatever grade that is. I use more quarter inch bolts. Oh, that's what I need right there. As long as my dry shaft and get a quarter inch nut. Get one of these flared ones. Star blocking washer on it. That should be good. Now let's go put it on the machine. Here we go. Got the quarter, new quarter inch bolt. I think it's the exact same bolt as the original one. Just broke off at the threads. Take that washer off. Reuse the washer. Stay over the hole because I only got one hand. There we go. I'm gonna go up with this. <clears throat> yep, well, I think I remember from last time. I really need to adjust this. Watch the belt and watch the pulley. I can turn the pulley, the belt doesn't move. Last time I remembered, I took the washer and put that on first and then run the bolt through the washer. I did it on both sides to put the nut on, but I had a bigger nut and it's off balance. Alright, I'm going to go and put that on and I'll come back with it on. Oh, it might be a cob job, but I'll get this job done maybe the next. I ran it with this bolt here for probably a couple of years. Because I used to have a nail in it. And about two weeks after I got this thing running and stuff, I broke. Gas is good. Oil is good. Now we can put these latches on. So that it rock out the garden field. And... Put these under the seat for next time. 
just in case it breaks again. Maybe you splice two together. Two halves make a hole. Alrighty. Now let's get to starting this thing. I got 20 minutes, half hour. Some choke on, and some choke. And the key. Chevy starts an international. Why 